Hello, how are you? Today we are going to review school subjects, math and clothes. The objectives are say a school subject in English, recognize a school subject, reading comprehension about the school, say math of the year in English, no clothes vocabulary, reading comprehension about clothes and colors. Please repeat after me. School subject. Math. Math. Music. Music. Art. Art. English, English, Spanish, Spanish, Geography, Geography, History, History, Science, Information Technology, Information Technology, Physical education, physical education. Now, which subject describes the sentence? Here, in this book, we have religion, science lab, Spanish, art, history, English, music, physical education, computer lab, and math. Number one, we learn how to use computers in the computer lab. Number two, in this subject you can learn to do experiments, science lab. Number three, we learn about what happened in the past, history. Number four, we learn more about our own language, Spanish. Number five, here we use crayons, colors, and paints. We learn how to draw art. Number six, it's a lovely time. We learn how to sing well. Music. Number seven, students enjoy it a lot. They can practice sports, physical education. Number eight, here we learn to speak another language, English. Number nine, I like this, we learn to add to subtract, to multiply and to divide, math. Number 10, in this subject we learn about God, religion. Now we are going to read and answer the question. Vamos a leer y responder las preguntas. Hi, I'm Pedro. This is my school. I start classes at 8 a.m. In my classroom, I sing songs and talk about important things. I have 15 minutes break time in the morning and in the afternoon. I play with my friends in the playground. I have lunch in the casino. I go home at 3.15. I like play football after school and I go home at Five o'clock once a week. Remember, the name is Pedro. The classes start at 8 a.m. He likes singing songs, talk about important things. He has 15 minutes break. Remember, the break time is el recreo. 
yeah, 15 minutes break time in the morning, en la mañana, and in the afternoon, after lunch. Después del lunch, hablamos de las afternoon. Yeah, he like to play with his friends in the playground. Then, have lunch in the casino. Uh, he go home at 3.15. He plays football after school, después del colegio, ya, yeah? and he goes home at 5 o'clock once a week. Remember, once, una vez, once a week. Answer true or false. En su guía ustedes tenían que responder true or false y correct the false. Number one. Pedro start classes at 8.30. False. Start at 8. Number two. In the classroom, Pedro sings songs. This is true. Number three. Pedro has three break time. False. Just two break time. Remember, in the morning and in the afternoon. Number four. Pedro plays in the computer room. False. Play football. Number five. Pedro goes home at three. False. At 3.30. Number six. Pedro plays football once a week. This is true. ¿Hiciste esta actividad en tus guías de trabajo de la casa? Si está todo perfecto, well done. Si no, tienes que revisar y corregir, ¿ya? Month of the year. Number one, January. Number two, February. Number three, March. Number four, April. Number five, May. Number six, June. Number seven, July. Number eight, August. Number nine, September. Number ten, October. Number eleven, November. And number twelve, December. Para desarrollar esta actividad te voy a pedir que aprendas muy bien a decir los meses en español, los meses del año, ¿ya? ¿Por qué? Porque si no, después te va a costar mucho hacer la actividad. ¿ah? Entonces, porque hay que reconocer eh, qué mes está después de, qué mes está antes de. ¿ah? Y si no lo tienes claro en español, ¿ah? se va a ser muy complejo hacer la actividad en in inglés. ¿Ya? Complete the sentence. Look at the vocabulary. Number one, before. Number two, between. Number three, after. Number four, the first. E number five, the last. Activity. Number one, the month, the last month is December. Remember, the last, el último. The last month is December. Number two. The month between July and September is August. Between. The month between July and September. August. You have to say July, August, September. Number three. The month before January is December. Before January, antes, before January, antes de enero, is December. Number four. The month after March is April. January, February, March, April. Number five, the second month is February, January, February. Number six, 
Number six. The ninth month is September. September. Seven. The seventh month is July. January, February, March, April, May, June, July. Number eight. The first month is January. Number nine. The third month is March. January, February, March. This is the third month, el tercero. Number ten. The eighth month is August. The eighth. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. This is the eighth month, el octavo mes. Eleven. The fourth month is April. January, February, March, April. Number 12. The sixth month is June. Number 13. The fifth month is May. Number 14. The eleventh month is November. Complete the chart with the missing months. Esta tabla era bastante simple porque solamente tenías que poner eh, el mes que viene antes o después según estu era completar la tabla, según estuviese esa, esa tabla. Por ejemplo, aquí dice, tenía puesto December y in your left side, en tu lado izquierdo, you have to put November. And in your right side, January. Yeah. Then up here in January, the next one is February and the next one March. If you see here in September, before September is August, and before August is July. Here I have August and um, before. August is July and after August it is September. Use the calendar for answer the question. Este eh, calendario lo tienen que mirar muy bien para poder responder la actividad siguiente. Now we are going to review this calendar, October calendar. And we are going to check and answer the question. Vamos a responder las preguntas. Yeah? Number one. How many Mondays are on the October calendar shown in the picture? We look the calendar. Here is Monday. We count. One. Two. Three. Four, five, five Monday. Here is the answer, five Mondays. Number two. How many weekend days are there on the October calendar? Remember, weekends means fin de semana, yeah? Saturday and Sunday. Saturday, sábado, Sunday, domingo. Yeah? How many weekend days are there on the October calendar? We are going to count the days. Vamos a contar los días. Here we have Saturday. One, two, three, four, five. Sunday. Sunday, one, two, three, four, five. The answer is ten. Ten week 
we can taste. Hmm? Then, number three, how many weekdays are there on the calendar? We are going to show you the weekdays. Remember, weekdays, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. That's it, 21. We are going to check the week day. Review. Number four, Columbus Day is celebrated on the second Monday in October. What is the date of Columbus Day? It's the second Monday. We are going to go there. The second Monday. The second Monday. Here is Monday. Monday. Again, Monday. The first. Monday, the second Monday here is the second Monday is 10. Number five, Mary circled her birthday on the calendar. Her birthday party is four days later, cuatro días después, at the birthday party. On what day is her party? We are going to count here. I show you here. This is the birthday, Mary's birthday. But she is going to celebrate four days later. One, two, three, four. Sunday, 23rd. The Cloth. Cloth vocabulary. Trousers or pants. Number two. Shorts. Number three. Socks. Number four. Shoes. Number five, skirt. Number six, sweater. Number seven, dress. Number eight, t-shirt. Number nine, boot. Number ten, coat. Number eleven, shirt. Number twelve, scarf. Number 13, hat. Number 14, gloves. Number 15, sandals. What is he wearing? Read and color the picture. ¿Qué está usando Felipe, no es cierto? What is he wearing? Now, read. Vamos a read and color. Leer y colorear the picture. La imagen, ¿ya? Yeah? He is Felipe. Number one. He is wearing orange hat. Color the hat orange. Number one. Number two. He is wearing yellow and green scarf. Look at the scarf and put there yellow and green. Number three. He is wearing purple gloves. Number four, he is wearing brown and red 
sweater. Number five, he is wearing black pants. Number six, he is wearing pink socks and brown shoes. Okay, uh, here I put links in YouTube links for review subjects. Um, what do you study at the school, month of the year, and clothes. Um, I want to say thank you for sharing the activity, and we are going to see very soon. Mm -hmm. Goodbye.